Did you know that the average temperature on Mars is minus 80 degrees Fahrenheit? That's almost 200 degrees colder than the average temperature on Earth. Mars and Earth may both be planets in our solar system, but they're vastly different in many ways. In this video, we're going to explore the unique features and characteristics of these two planets and uncover the surprising differences you may not know about. So get ready for a fascinating journey to the red planet as we explore the exciting differences between Mars and Earth. Mars is smaller and less massive than Earth. Mars has a diameter of about 6,779 kilometers, which is about half the size of Earth's diameter of about 12 to 742 kilometers. In other words, you could fit two Mars planets inside the Earth. Mars has a mass of about 639 x 10.23 kilograms, which is only about 11% of Earth's mass of about 5.97 x 10.24 kilograms. This means that Mars is much less massive than Earth. The atmosphere of Mars is different from that of Earth in many ways. Mars's atmosphere is mostly made up of carbon dioxide, with small amounts of nitrogen, argon and oxygen. In contrast, Earth's atmosphere is mainly composed of nitrogen and oxygen, with trace amounts of other gases like carbon dioxide and argon. The atmospheric pressure on Mars is much lower than that of Earth due to its smaller size and weaker gravity. The surface pressure on Mars is only about 1% of Earth's surface pressure. Mars is also much colder than Earth, with an average temperature of 63 degrees Celsius, while the average temperature on Earth is around 15 degrees Celsius. One major difference is that Mars lacks a strong magnetic field like Earth, which means that its atmosphere is not protected from the solar wind. As a result, the solar wind can strip away the atmosphere over time, making it thinner than Earth's atmosphere. The climate of Mars is much different than that of Earth. Mars experiences intense dust storms that can cover the entire planet, lasting for weeks or even months. These storms are caused by strong winds that pick up dust and debris from the Martian surface. Earth, on the other hand, has a more varied weather pattern, including hurricanes, thunderstorms, and snowstorms. Mars experiences seasons like Earth, but they are much more extreme. This is because Mars has a more elliptical orbit which causes the distance between the planet and the Sun to vary greatly over the course of a year. As a result, Mars's seasons are much longer and more extreme than Earth's. Mars also experiences extreme temperature variations, with temperatures ranging from 140 degrees Celsius at the poles to 20 degrees Celsius near the equator. This is due to Mars's thin atmosphere, which cannot trap heat like Earth's thicker atmosphere. The geology of Mars is different from that of Earth in many ways. Mars's surface is primarily made up of volcanic rock and iron-rich minerals, while Earth's surface is more varied, with a mix of sedimentary, metamorphic, and igneous rocks. Mars has evidence of past water on its surface, including dried-up riverbeds and ancient lake beds. Earth, on the other hand, has a lot of water on its surface, with over 70% of its surface covered in oceans. Mars has some unique geological features, including Olympus Mons, which is the largest volcano in the solar system, and Valles Marineris, which is a system of canyons that stretches across the planet. Earth has active plate tectonics, which means that the surface is constantly moving and changing. Mars, on the other hand, does not have active plate tectonics and has a more stable surface. The potential for life on Mars and Earth depends on many factors, Life as we know it requires certain conditions to survive, such as the presence of water, a stable environment, and a source of energy. Earth has all of these conditions, which has allowed for the development and diversity of life on our planet. Mars, on the other hand, is a harsh environment with extreme temperatures, radiation, and a thin atmosphere, making it difficult for life to survive. Despite the harsh conditions on Mars, Recent discoveries have shown that there may be potential for life. For example, scientists have found evidence of past water on the planet, as well as organic molecules, which are the building blocks of life. Additionally, NASA's Mars 2020 mission is currently searching for signs of ancient microbial life on the planet. While Mars may not be as hospitable to life as Earth, 
it still offers a unique opportunity to study the potential for life on other planets. By comparing the conditions on Mars to those on Earth, scientists can better understand the factors that are necessary for life to thrive. In conclusion, Mars and Earth are two very different planets. Earth has an atmosphere that provides oxygen and protects us from harmful radiation, while Mars has a very thin atmosphere and no magnetic field. Earth has a lot of liquid water, while Mars has mostly frozen water. Earth is much warmer than Mars, with an average temperature of around 15 degrees Celsius, while Mars is much colder, with an average temperature of around 63 degrees Celsius. Despite these differences, Mars is still a fascinating planet to study and explore. It is possible that in the future, humans could live on Mars, but there are many challenges that must be overcome first, such as finding ways to produce food and oxygen, dealing with the extreme cold and radiation, and protecting the planet from contamination. As we continue to learn more about Mars and the universe around us, we should also remember to take care of our own planet Earth. It is the only home we have, and we must work together to protect it and ensure its survival for generations to come. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. We would love to hear your thoughts on this topic so please leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more valuable content like this. Stay tuned for our next video. Thanks for watching.